Welcome to the Tech Talks Daily Podcast, where you can learn and be inspired by real-world examples of how technology is transforming businesses and reshaping industries in a language everyone can understand. Here is your host, Neil C. Hughes. Welcome back to the Tech Talk Daily Podcast. Now, as you all know by now, one of my big motivations around recording this podcast every day for 365 days a year It's the human stories behind how people are leveraging technology to solve real-world problems, whether that be in their lives, in their work, or even change the world. For example, when I heard about a tech company that allows sellers to cross-post unlimited products across 12 different online platforms all at once, it had an obvious appeal around saving time. But when I dug a little deeper... I came across the story of two non-technical founders and a woman who had deliberating arthritis at a relatively young age and a friend who believed in her and spent two years learning to code to help build the software and then that they bootstrapped their way to success. I felt both inspired and compelled to find out more. So buckle up and hold on tight as I beam your ears all the way to Phoenix, Arizona, where Clara Albanoz from List Perfectly, is going to share her inspirational bootstrapping startup story. So, a massive warm welcome to the show. Can you tell the listeners a little about who you are and what you do? Hi, thank you for having me here, Neil, and thank you for receiving me with your incredible audience. My name is Clara Albornoz. I'm the co-founder of Least Perfectly. I'm also the co-CEO. Um, and Least Perfectly is a software for e-commerce that will help you to list products on one platform, and then you can take it concurrently and simultaneously to 12 different platforms. So you don't have to do this manually on every, for example, you don't have to list manually on eBay, then Poshmark, on Mercari. You just do it once in List Perfectly, and then just go to all these marketplaces. And then we can help you to manage that inventory. And then we give you data analytics so you can grow your business in the right direction. I am so excited because this solution was built for me, Neil, just for me. And I never thought this would be, (laughs) we would make this available to tens of thousands of users. (laughs) Oh, I love that. And before we get started and find out more information about what it is, what it does, et cetera, before you came on the podcast, I read that it was your arthritis that prevented you from listing your own products as a seller on on multiple different platforms. But can I ask you, share that origin story and and where the idea for List Perfectly came from? Certainly, Neil. Uh, It was a combination of, hey, how come these solutions are available only for um, big companies, like, you know, big companies, right? And then we were, and as we're exploring solutions, I started to, my health took a turn. I was very young. I used to run marathons, snowboard, you name it. I did it all. And I, I noticed I started to have back problems. And then it became elbow problems. And then it was shoulder problems. And then collarbone. And I was like, what's going on here? I go to the doctor and I was only 41, Neil. Wow. And uh, they tell me you have deformative arthritis or AKA osteoarthritis. And I couldn't believe it. It just started to deform my hands. And uh, I'm only 48 right now. So I don't know what would I've done without this perfectly because it was desperation. And uh, I wanted to go into disability. And my co-founder, Amanda, she's the technical partner. I'm the non-technical partner. She says, I wanted to quit reselling online and, and just take disability. I was defeated. Neil. And she tells me, no, I'm going to teach myself coding. We're going to build this platform, what we need. Okay. And we're going to make it happen. And so we did. I, for two years, I, with medicine and a lot of sacrifice, I've, um, I was able to finance myself, um, in bootstrap, uh, the first person of this port this perfectly at that time was called the Amanda Mandy Lister. And then it was called <laughs> List Clothing. <laughs> and then when we could offer our services for everything, we called it List Perfectly. Wow, what an inspirational story. And I think we all have things that happen in our lives. And it's very easy to fall into the trap of self-pity and thinking, well, what's the point? And, you know, what, there's nothing I can do about this. But I just love your attitude there and how you and your friend there, I've spent two years creating this 
and, and creating this solution. But for, for anyone listening that's hearing about it for the first time, what is List Perfectly and what makes it different from, from other solutions out there? So List Perfectly is an e-commerce solution that we built in order to help you list manage listings to different platforms, then manage that inventory and grow your business in the right direction by providing you data analytics. Also, we provide additional services like image background remover. Um, we can help you also to uh, delist, release, and mark sold. So many things that resellers need in order to grow their businesses in the right direction. And if we go back, what, 10, 15 years ago, the only place that people would make things and sell things on would be eBay. But, of course, the world's very different now. And you just said there are tw over 12 different platforms, and people want to be on all those platforms, and it would just take too long to, uh, to actually individually list it on each and every one of those platforms. So can you walk me through how it works and, and the kind of time that you're yeah. saving sellers? That's right. So um, the one of the things that I wanted to add, you know, Neil, is that one what makes this perfectly so unique and different from any other solutions is that because of my legal background and because of my co-founder, she comes from a military background. For us, following terms of service is very important. So our solution makes so um, it makes growing your business in the right direction with never fearing to get suspended or maybe to even be losing, okay, the right to uh, work with the marketplace. We will help you cross post, delist, release, and mark sold listings and more from eBay, Facebook, Poshmark, Mercari, Kittison, Shopify, Instagram, Tradesy, Grailed, Depop, Etsy. And soon we're going to be announcing a, another channel that we're so excited. Wow. And the thing is, if if we look around the world, th this podcast listened to in 165 countries, and I would say in every single one of those countries, there is so much economic uncertainty at the moment. So yeah. we're, we're all reading so many doom and gloom stories. Do you have any feel good stories of how you've seen things like side hustles from selling on peer to peer marketplaces, how they've become full full time gigs as well? Do you get to hear any stories like that? Absolutely, Neil. It's just daily. Um, because we have no advertising, I bootstrap, I, I finance this company myself, no investors. Everything you see is authentic. We, we have no need to impress investors. Yeah. So every day you can see my social media channels. You can see it on Facebook group. Okay. You can see it on Instagram. You can see it on TikTok or you can see it all uh, as well on YouTube. The stories in our podcast or in the seller community podcast or even in our, we have blog posts on our least perfectly site. Incredible stories. We have people that quit their full-time uh, jobs in corporate America because it has become a little, the, 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 the culture of corporate America has taken a turn uh, with uh, the pandemic. So that has propelled a lot of uh, U.S. people uh, to go and explore uh, being entrepreneurs. And e-commerce is such a low entry point versus uh, let's say crypto or real estate, right? So you can see daily on all my channels. Thank you, Liz, perfectly. Thank you, Clara. Thanks to you, uh, I've been able to quit my job and now I make six digits, okay, plus in the, I'm so happy. I wake up when I want. I go to bed when I want and uh, I'm my own boss. So it's incredible. Many people also do it as a side gig and uh, that's also incredible. So they work their full-time jobs and then they come at home and and they partner, whether it's their life partners or a business partner, and then they partner with someone, and that's how they're able to grow so fast they're reselling. And it's, you see, daily, Neil, is so rewarding. Um, sometimes people ask me, Clara, how do you do to go live? F sometimes three, four times a week is because of the community. When you hear people telling you thank you, and they're touching you like a rock star, Neil. You know, it's like, yeah. thank you. I don't know what, and I'm like, <laughs> and I understand because I did it for myself. But again, I go back, I never thought a solution that was built for me, Neil, good help, um, <laughs> over 40,000 people, okay? Never, never in my wildest dreams. And to receive that gratitude, uh, you can see it everywhere, um, you know, in the, 
like I said, we don't pay advertising, nothing. Um, it's just incredible. It's so rewarding. It keeps me going. It keeps me going, Neil. Oh, that is absolutely amazing. And I'd love to, uh, well, I especially love what you're doing and how you're using technology to bring all that together and just to bring to life everything that we're talking about here. Let's say I'm somebody into crafting and I I love creating yeah. personalized gifts for people that want unique gifts for their loved ones rather than bland off the shelf products from a big chain store. Yeah. Can you walk me through how to get up and running and list items on multiple platforms at once? Yeah. So what you, that, this is a great question. My favorite question, Neil, because you can learn to list, okay, on eBay, on Etsy, on Shopify, on Instagram individually, or you can learn to list and list perfectly, then understand what marketplaces will allow you to list and then take those listings from list perfectly to different platforms. And then we take care of, of the hard work of taking the images, product description, uh, details, imagine all the, the, the shipping, um, SKU, so many things that sellers need to keep yourself organized so you can grow the business in the right direction. And what I also love is you spent two years building a technology platform here. But it, for you, it seems to be, from talking to you, it's all about your community. So what kind of feedback have you received from your community? Do, do you ever hear of anyone returning to listing on individual platforms and saying, oh, I'm just going to go back to doing it on just eBay or just Etsy? Or what, what kind of feedback are you getting at the moment? <laughs> I, that's my favorite, too. We <laughs> receive that, you know, obviously, you know, because we have five days Yep. And 50 listings for free, absolutely for free. So we have a lot of people that can, they test, okay? They do the 50 listings. I'm like, no, I'm going to go back and do it manually. Or maybe I'm going to try another free service, let's say, okay? There's many services now uh, doing this. And then they go, or free service, or they go with another service. And again, please keep in mind that we are resellers, Neil. Yeah. I am a reseller. I built this because I am a, I'm not a developer, an engineer. I don't have to go do uh, research and development and then do a poll to see what I have to build. I already know what I have to build. So you see the advantage that we have over other, any other solution. So built by resellers for resellers, we already have that advantage. I don't have to ask. We get a lot of feedback, like the most common feedback that we get is like list perfectly um <laughs> did it again uh another feature that i didn't know i needed and now i cannot live without and this is you can, you're gonna see it everywhere because yeah. again we're resellers so i've been there i've done that i've i paid my mortgage i paid off my house i paid off my debt by reselling online look at my company's debt free i own it a hundred percent and all this thanks to reselling online. So I do hear sometimes people when I go back to do it manually, I hear sometimes that with younger generations that they might be like a, in a very tight budget, but then they realize time is money. So you could do it manually and then they come back, okay, it's an investment, I'll do it. <laughs> And, and confession time, 20 years ago, I was a big eBay guy and I just <laughs> frequent a lot of the, the communities back then, the reseller communities. And there, there was a lot of concern around the rise in eBay fees because by the time eBay took the money, by the time fee, PayPal had took their cut as well, yeah. it didn't leave that much. So how does your fee structure work? Yeah, no, we kept it simple. Again, because we're resellers, you're going to see that, <laughs> you know, we kept it so simple. We have three plans, 29 49 and 69 and there is never add-ons there is never extra fees there is never a cancellation fee or if you're going to change plans we even prorate because i came from banking neil um also you know i love you know numbers so we also prorate balances other services will just when you downgrade they'll just just you lose the money okay and uh, that's what we did you know understanding i didn't want my customers to worry about fees i want them focus on growing the, their business because when they grow, I grow. So that's what we did. Keep it simple, simple plan 29. Business plan uh, is going to be 49. And then the pro plan is 69. That's our most comprehensive plan. That was the least perfectly plan that I had when I built and expanded all my businesses. And that's how I made it to um, make half a million dollars just. And, and again, you know, keep in mind, Neil, that this is 
not the, I'm reselling one of a kind vintage clothing. So yeah. imagine you buy them for one dollar and then you're selling them for 150 to 100. Wow. So I've got to ask, where do you go from here? I mean, how are you going to continue leveraging technology to keep evolving with the demands of your community? Because everything uh -huh. seems to be constantly evolving, doesn't it, and changing. Where, you, where do you go from here? Oh, th that's a great question because what we want to do is keep upgrading and evolving least perfectly to make the listing process as smooth as, as possible and intuitive. Um, we're working very hard. Soon we're going to be um, adding incredible features like uh, we're going to be removing uh, listings uh, from when they sell out from marketplaces now that they don't allow that. So it's we're, um, we're so excited that we don't have to hack the system and we're working with these platforms to bring an incredible experience to our community. And that's nice to see that the different platforms we work with, they are so supportive of what we do in 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 for us to have that support in the community propels us to take this perfectly to the next level. So big things are coming. We're going to be launching another plan uh, of Lead for this perfectly because we got to carry out another segment of our e-commerce incredible uh, community. And uh, big things are coming, Neil. Big things. Oh, sounds exciting. Now, of course, none of us are able to achieve any level of success without a little help along the way. And sometimes on the podcast, I like to just give a general nod and thank you to a particular person that you might be grateful towards who helped you get you where you are today. Who would you like to thank if you if you look back at your career and what you've achieved here? Yeah, I have to say <laughs> thank you. The one person that always believed in me, yeah. that never quit on me. Even in the darkest days, you know, oh, thank you, Amanda Morse, for always believing in me. And uh, where would I be without my co-founder? I strongly encourage everybody that is listening to this podcast to find yourself a friend that believes in you like I did because it changed my life. That's beautiful and such a powerful moment to end on. But before I do let you go, for anyone interested in List, List Perfectly or anything that we've talked about today, where's the best starting point for everything? And maybe if somebody wants to reach out, contact you or a member of your team if they've got any questions, where should they start? Yeah, so we have a strong presence in social media. Um, you could come, you know, to, if you, to any, for example, Facebook group where you can have dialogues. I'm there if you want. Or you can go to our website, www.listperfectly.com, and then select contact us, and our team will answer your questions. But we strongly recommend you to start in our community. Uh, Facebook is a great channel that I like or a YouTube live every Friday, 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. I go live um, um, to talk about any concerns about the community. For example, this Friday, I'm talking about listing optimization. And then if you have questions and you want to have a dialogue with me, you come to Facebook group. Sometimes you can send me messages on List Perfectly Inc. on Instagram, or I even go live on TikTok. On TikTok, I, on List Perfectly, I talk a lot about motivation. I'm very motivated and I love sharing my motivation with my community well i always say at the end of every episode technology works best when it brings people together and i love how you you went through some pretty dark times there but you found a way out you spent two years building this platform and you've used technology to unite forty thousand people in the world to post across 12 different platforms you should be incredibly proud of what you've achieved here i'd love to follow your story and get you back on in the future see how things are going but more than anything just thank you for sharing your powerful story today thank you neil thank you so much for having me here so yes list perfectly is this versatile e-commerce solution for sellers to efficiently list and cross post products on multiple major marketplaces and channels such as instagram shopify ebay and all the usual suspects but i think it was how it was created by amanda and clara for sellers just like them who make a living from their online sales and as a solution to frustrating and laborious processes of listing on multiple channels. And anyone, even if you've just got a bit of a side hustle to make some money on the side, anyone that has tried that will know how cumbersome it is. So they've solved a real problem. 
But more than anything, it's the story behind List Perfectly and that community that they've built and how Clara is still talking directly to that community to this day. That shines a light even more so than the technology in this case. So a big thank you to Clara for coming on and sharing her story. And remember, I want to get more stories like this on the podcast. So if this story resonated with you, maybe you've got your own story you'd like to share of how you've used technology to make a difference. I'd love to hear more. So please email me, techblogwriter at outlook.com, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram at Neil C. Hughes. You can send me a DM on there. And also my website is techblogwriter.co.uk if you'd like to work with me. But I'm afraid that's it for today. So a big thank you for listening as always. And until next time, don't be a stranger. Thank you for listening to the Tech Talks Daily Podcast with Neil C. Hughes. Remember, technology works best when it brings people together.